All right, guys. Uh, welcome to the Adobe Photoshop channel called Photoshop in a Room. But this video is in English because um, I just uploaded it for my friends. And uh, in this video, we're gonna go and study this laser tool, which is uh, which is the selection tool and give you the freehand selection and uh, the shortcut key which we're going to use for this tool is L I mean if you choose any kind of a tool so just press L from your keyboard to select this uh, laser tool alright it gives you a freehand selection I mean it's not like a rectangle marquee tool and it's not like a I mean elliptical marquee tool it's just it just gives you a freehand selection with the feeder and all the selection options which are available for the rectangle marquee tool alright click this uh, laser tool if it's not selected I mean just right click on this laser tool you got so many other tools uh, for the selection but I'm gonna go and use the laser tool for this video and just click at any point of your picture and keep dragging your mouse alright that's good just join the selection and you will go to the selection alright if I come to this edit copy edit paste so now you can see that I've got the selection, but the but the edges of this selection is so hard actually. I mean, it's 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 nice if I put it in here, but I mean, if you've got the soft edges, it will look more nice actually. So I mean, this is the way you get the selection. I'm just gonna go and drag this to crush cam and get my laser tool again. But this time I'm gonna have put the feed on about 20 percent. I mean, and just want to take the same selection. Just get some rows. Alright, just join again. You've got the selection, come to this edit, copy, edit, paste, take your move tool, and now you can see that I've got this very cute selection. You can you cannot see even the edges of this selection. I'm gonna put it here, press Alt from your keyboard, make sure you you've selected this move tool and click Alt from your keyboard and press sorry and click and drag. You got two more Roses, click and drag this rose again. Click and drag this rose again. I mean, you can you can make even hundred roses at a time. But this is the way you can uh, select freehand by this laser tool. Make sure that uh, you remember this uh, shortcut key because if you are, if you want to be a professional, just use the shortcut keys of the of these tools. And um, so, uh, how to add selection to the selection? I'm going to select these uh, extra flowers and drag them to the recycle bin. Alright, and put the feeder about 0%, press enter to confirm that, and make sure that you've selected this first selection option, new selection options, and I'm going to go and drag this. Alright, I've got the selection. Now, I'm going to go and click this add selection and select this rose again alright now you can see I've got these two flowers selected and if I, if I select this one so now you can see I've got this uh, this kind of a selection I add a selection to this previous selection so what I'm going to do to add more alright I've got the selection of these three cute flowers roses sorry and uh, same like that I can cut some selection or you can hit subtract some selection or if I need the inner I mean the inner area if I need the inner area of this selection so I'm gonna go and choose this lost uh, option and click something like this so it, it's gonna go and select the inner area alright that's cool so this is how you can use these options and select your move tool again but before that deselect the selection selection move tool so this is a laser tool which gives you a free hand selection you can add a selection to a selection or cut or get the inner area you can uh, put it feeders like about 20 10 I mean that really depends on you and uh, that's how the laser tool works and I hope you really enjoy this video thank you very much